Hello, everybody. Welcome again for one question a day. The chapter that we are discussing is development of teeth. And the question that we are saying is about dental lamina or the fate of dental lamina. If this question comes in the exam, the key should be you have to discuss what is dental lamina. You have to talk about the primary epithelial band formation of dental lamina. Perhaps with the help of a diagram, line diagram would be helpful. Then you have to describe what is the fate of dental lamina, how it disintegrates with probably with the diagram, how the teeth erupts into the oral cavity via a natural break in the continuity of oral epithelium, how this happens, how this facilitates the clinical consideration, the enamel pearl, odentome, gingivitis, periodontitis, where the integrity of junctional epithelium is compromised altogether. You have to discuss in this. Going into the answer sheet, Dental lamina, you have to start where and when, how it starts. About fourth week of intrauterine life in the primitive oral cavity, there is horseshoe shaped proliferation of ectomies and chymal cells into deep into the uh, tissues surrounding ectomies and chymal cells that is called as primary epithelial band that are about, at about seventh week that differentiates into a vestibular band or the buccal band or the dental lamina or the inner band that gives rise or holds the tooth germs. And which in bud stage has enamel organ, dental papilla, and dental sac. The better thing would be this diagram. Horseshoe shape, each one of this, proliferation downwards, epithelial band, invasion into the surrounding thickening of connective tissue that gives rise to your thing. This differentiates into a dental lamina, which is lingual, buccal lamina, which is your vestibular lamina. And this is this stage. The cap stage, the dental lamina extends into the cap stage and the early bell stage, it starts to disintegrate. Rather, at this stage, at the early bell stage, there is evidence of the dental lamina starting to disintegrate and completely gone by the late bell stage. This is very important. And that is where the dental lamina's fate is very important. The dental lamina in the advanced or early to advanced bell state loses its continuity with the enamel organ, often disintegrates, undergoes apoptosis, the epithelium and often resolved, it goes off. Okay. In case of early breakup or persistent of these cells in the gingiva, a cell rest of cell rays are often associated with cystine tumors or associated with conditions like enamel pearl, accessory root formation, which are associated with her subnormality. So this is what is about dental lamina, how primary epithelial band about fourth to seventh week, sixth week, formation of dental lamina, diagram, fate of demel, dental lamina, disintegration, and how it contributes to all these issues. With that, this question on dental lamina, is over. It is often, not very often asked, but still a good while to understand the concept of how dental lamina, how you should answer this question as. Happy learning and join us in this channel for another session.